Hey guys, welcome back to Lucha High. But since he got a phone, this is going to be my YouTube channel now. And today I'm going to teach you how to paint a Valentine's poster. The first thing you need is kind of an expo marker that is a velvo velvet color. Okay. And you gotta open it. Uh, can you open this? Okay. Uh, one of the thing, the first thing you have to do is kind of a small heart. It could be any type of heart you want. But I like to use this color because it's a nice and c kind of purpley-ish, pinkish color for Valentine's. And like other hoods, you have to draw another one. That's what you have to do for the hood. You gotta put the mug away. Hold on, I'll be right back. I just have to get a little paint canvas easel. Then you're gonna need one of these paint canvases palettes. And you are going to need the colors pink and red. So let me go get those colors real quick and I'll be back. It could be neon pink or neon orange, whatever colors makes you feel like a happy Valentine's. For me, I'm going to go with this cute neon pink. I use it a lot because it's my favorite paint color. And I'm going to go with this calm pink. So that's all. The, you only need two paint colors and then we'll move on to another paint color. Point to that camera. Now you have to pour the paint. Uh. Squeeze. And then I can't squeeze this one out because I use a lot of it. So I'm just gonna paint out of it from the canvas. Is this two? Oh, this is two. Okay. So then you have to take a paintbrush. It could be any size. For me, I like this size. Then you're gonna dip the paintbrush in the paint and you could color the inside hood or the outside hood with, with whatever color you want. For me, I'm going to paint the outside. And I'm not going to do all of the outside, but when you do do all the outside, I'm going to show you what it looks like at the end. But you should do the whole outside with that one color, and then you're going to move on to the inside of the hood the inside of the hood. You, got, you should probably, for me, I like to keep this little jar of water so I can wash my paintbrush. Got some water in the floor, but I'll clean that up after. Then I like to dry it on my hand and then wipe it on my easel. But now I need one of my favorite pink colors. I like it wet because I don't have that much of a color and this helps you get more of the color. Then you have to paint inside the little hood. This might take a while. After you finish the whole, like this hood and the inside hood, you will take black paint and, hold on, gotta get more paint. Then after this, you can use any paint, color paint or black paint. To me, I prefer purple paint because I just like it, and to me, it's a calm Valentine's color. So then you're going to paint the inside of the hood, and like I said, you paint the whole hood. But now we're going to move on to a different color. I'm Instead of using purple, I'm going to use red Crayola paint, and I'm going to write Happy Valentine's Day. But... Since um, it's kind of hard, you need an outline. So you can take any type of marker, it shows the anything, and write happy. When I wipe my wife, I like to do this, and then whenever it's a holiday, I'll draw a hood since it's Valentine's. Happy Val in Times Day.
and that's what you want. It doesn't have to be that small. Hold on, I forgot something. This should be a little E right there, but not little. Make sure it's B. Make sure it's a big. I do mind just a little happy so you know how to do it. Oh, my mom's gonna fix Valentine's for you. Valentine's, that's how you spell it. So I made a mistake because I'm still, I'm still little and kids make mistakes. Then you're gonna take your paintbrush again and you're gonna, you can leave it black or, and just paint the hood in, or you could paint the whole board like this to make a cool design kind of, whatever you prefer. But I'm going to finish up the hood so you know what it looks like. But I have to, hold on, uh, paint this hood real quick. To me, I'm, go I'm gonna paint a better version for my family but for now, um, I just it's just something for you guys. So I'm gonna finish this up real quick. This is a really fun activity to do at home. I prefer white paper, but if you do do it on black paper or colored paper, I would suggest to use a white pen for the hood so that way you know what to do. I'm trying to paint a little fast here for you guys so you're not waiting being bored. But like I said, um, we're not done. There's gonna be more details in the hood and stuff like that. Except we're not going to use Valentine colors. You can use whatever color you want. But inside this hood, I like to do polka dots because if you didn't know me, I'm a huge, 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 huge Disney fan. And polka dots remind me of Minnie Mouse's bow and dress. So I'm not going to... I'll get all the little white spots later. But then, like I said, you usually wash your brush. And you can use any color you want. I'm gonna use teal, this color teal, cause it's pretty. And I know my family likes the color teal too, cause it's a type of blue, an ocean. Cause we also like to go to Castaway K. And then you could do as much things, you could do little hoods inside the hoods, whatever makes your hood feel like you. Cause Valentine's is all about loving and caring, I think. <laughs> You could do polka dots on the outside, which I am, because I think it would be cute. But since I do like Disney, I'm going to draw a little Mickey Mouse. <laughs> I'm going to go a little faster now, just so you guys aren't bored. And that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Bye.